Hello and welcome. So I thought I would share with you all the things I got for Christmas as well as my birthday because my birthday is in November so it's kind of close and just share with you what it's what I got. This is probably the Christmas where I've gotten the least amount of items which is very nice and it's kept it quite simple and minimal for me. However, family members don't always listen to us so I do have a few random things to show you that I don't know why I got but apart from that um yeah my family do pretty well um my mum and dad and most of my family members always respect my wish which is always just for money and that's just so I can have experiences or just have some savings or whatever it is I always explain it to them in a very positive way and not saying it's not that you're not putting thought into it it's actually you're putting more thought into it because you're actually giving me freedom to do whatever it is my heart desires um so I always find like when you actually receive an object it's more limiting so my mum and dad always respect that um my mum always tries to give me some kind of token so for my 18th she gave me this ring and I believe because it was my 21st she got me a necklace but I haven't seen it yet she's going to bring it over with her when she comes to visit and yeah then apart from that it's just my grandma who always insists on buying me things and so I try and be constructive and I go look Nan like I really really don't want anything but if you must must get me something you can get me some long johns is what I asked for this year because I didn't have any and it's really cold where I am so she did listen to that but um yeah so she got me a pair of long john bottoms and a top and I really appreciated that and she also got me some tights so these are from oh John Lewis so these are really nice good quality tights but I haven't used them yet because I still have ones that I'm currently using that are open and then this is the random thing she got me um, which is adult coloring in books I think because she saw me coloring in in one of these books once and my grandma's the type of person that if she sees you doing it once or you mention that you like it once you will continue to receive items related to that one thing so that's why I have these but I'm going to keep them and I think I'm going to re-gift them to someone else at some point for their birthday or whatever it is I'm sure I can pass these along there's a little lady in my house that loves to color so I'm sure I could give them to her um and then the only other thing I received uh, was a beanie this is from my friend, she knitted it, crocheted it for me because she saw that I didn't have one and that I was really cold with that one so that was really nice that my friend gave me that. And then the thing about my nan and her generation is that all her friends like to send me things as well so her, one of her friends knitted me these gloves as well as a hat and a scarf. Now with the scarf I gave it to my secret Santa because I already had one and I didn't need a scarf and with the hat I have misplaced it somewhere I'm sure it's just in one of my coat pockets but I couldn't find it to show you um, so that is what I got as well and I think I got three birthday cards um, one for my grandma one from one of my grandma's friends and one from the lady who knitted me these things as well so yeah I don't know it's just something about that generation right they always just love to send gifts and I believe it's because they grew up with a lot less than we had so they just always feel like yeah giving I have I, that's that's my theory on it if you have any other theories on it please share with me because I'm always interested so that's what I got for my birthday and then for Christmas I asked my grandma for more of the long john so I said I needed more bottoms so she got me two more pairs of bottoms and she got me another top as well that is more of like a singlet top instead of a long sleeve one and they're all like pure silk this one's silk and these ones are silk and cotton blend so I always really like good natural fiber quality ones because the non-natural fiber ones just make me feel like all uncomfortable but yes and then the other little random things that she got me because she always does that is one is this school this um london bus christmas tree decoration and the other one's this christmas tree decoration so i don't know she just sent this to me in a separate package being like oh this you know i was thinking of you and i thought you'd really like it and it'll remind you of london and then she sent this in a different one as well which is a little Christmas decoration and then she also sent me this candle from Muji which smells pretty good it's golden myrrh and yeah she sent that to me in one of my packages which was really nice and surprisingly I really love this candle it smells so good um, and then she also sent me cards of course so she sent me this card which is a little extravagant and then this card as well 
Um, I was also, I recycled my birthday cards, yeah, these are the only Christmas cards I have left. And this one's from my mum, which I love, which is a little lion with a Christmas hat on, which is always nice. And then for my boss at work, I just received this Christmas tree thing, which was from Lint, and then inside it was like, in there there was um, little lint balls, which was nice. And I'm going to keep the tree because I feel like I can use it as a Christmas decoration next year, or I can repurpose it, or reuse it, or give it to a, someone. So that's why I have this still. <laughs> and then my secret Santa, which was someone in my house, gave me this, which is a turtle neck thing um, because it's cold as well. So I've been loving this because I like put it on. I know it looks really great right but then I put my other big scarf on top of it and it just keeps me really nice and warm and so that was my secret Santa gift so that is everything I got and yeah I don't know I think it's a, something about the, the the grandma generation that just loves to give gifts and I don't think I can ever take that away from her so I just have to be constructive with what she sends me so I hope that was in some way interesting and um, yeah, please share with me what you said to your family members or if any of your family members actually respected what you wanted if you're trying to live a more minimal Christmas. That's actually a pretty nice card though. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye!